So the course, in my opinion, is pretty fantastic. It's got a little mix of everything, which is uh, something I really love about it. I mean, I've only been able to play it a couple times, but I know from, from what I've been able to see, I'm, I'm going to fall in love with it. It's been a real team effort on campus to, to get this done. When COVID hit, uh, we started thinking a lot more seriously about activities that could take place outside where it was natural to spread out. I think disc golf, the sport as a whole, has really benefited from COVID. Yes. It was a perfect time to go ahead and move forward with putting the course in. It doesn't cost anything for them. And like I said, it's a, it's a nice walk and uh, anybody can do it. It's another great way for the university community to get outside, enjoy some of the resources that we have on this campus that you may not see on a regular basis, including the woods and some of the other open space. And, and to just enjoy recreation and the benefits that come with it from, from hanging out with friends to exercise to just breathing fresh air, uh, just another way to do that. It's a great addition to the Dayton community. What I found unique about this course was the elevation. We had a couple of bomber downhills and some uphills. That's unique. We wanted a course that would challenge all levels, Actually made one. Um, but also be fair to maybe folks that haven't played before. One of the great things about this course is pretty much all of it plays through areas that are already maintained. Once the course goes in, the maintenance, other than cutting the grass, is pretty much nothing. So I'm just really excited to see how, when it finally finishes up, turns out what the disc golf community can do when they play it more. Uh, it's going to be a fantastic course. The comments on uh, local disc golf pages, uh, all you hear is everybody saying, hey, we're going to go play Wright State. It's something that I've been hoping they would do ever since I got into disc golf. Seeing this full 18 holes come into fruition with actual baskets and everything, it's, I almost want to say a dream come true.